in this video we are going to see how to delete rows and columns and if you want to delete multiple rows and columns uh, we will see how to handle that using google Apps script and that is what we are going to see in this video so first i will locate this sheet one let me name this as a sheet one i have to use an interface spreadsheet dot get active spreadsheet method and i have to use get sheet by name and i have to pass the sheet name here and the sheet name is a sheet one so i just put that over here and now let's assume that i want to delete a column c so to delete a column you have to use the sheet variable followed by delete column and this accept an integer and here you need to specify the position of the column so i just have to uh, pass the position three here let's check that out save the project and click on run it should delete the third row so it got deleted here and now let me reverse that so if you want to delete multiple columns let's see how to do that so let's assume that i want to delete two columns starting from the column d so what i have to do is i have to specify the position the first position i want to delete column d so the position of the column d is 4 and i want to delete two columns starting from the position d so i have to specify how many columns I want to delete in the second param now let's click on the run and it will delete D and E and okay so it's showing an exception the parameter don't match the method signature and one thing I missed here is I should use columns instead of column so if you just want to delete one column you have to use a method column and if you want to delete multiple column you have to use a method delete columns so now click on the run and go to this sheet okay so this two columns gets deleted now let me reverse that so this is all about deleting column and now let's see how to delete a row so just assume that i want to delete the row number six and it's super simple and you might have guessed you just need to use a method delete row and pass the position here so we just want to delete the sixth row just pass that and execute this it will delete the sixth row let me reverse that out and again if you want to delete multiple rows let's assume that i want to delete three rows starting from row four so i have to specify the starting position of the row and how many rows I want to delete I want to delete three rows so I'm just passing four comma three here and now if I click on the run it's going to delete four by six so that's it I deleted uh, those three rows and this is all about deleting the rows and columns I hope you like this video thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel bye bye